Greetings. I'm Dr. Powell. I'm professor of the World Music Center's class for 2022. We'll be going in j -term to five strategic cities in Europe. And these cities were homes of some of the greatest musicians that have ever lived. We'll go to their homes, we'll see their museums, we'll hear concerts of their music in the famous concert halls in which they wrote these pieces for. It's a very exciting time if you're a music enthusiast. This is a course that does not need to have an extensive knowledge of music, but it is designed to appeal to the most in-depth of music majors as well as someone who is just wanting to get an arts credit. We'll start in Vienna, and in Vienna is the home of the Habsburg Empire, and they were instrumental in hiring some of the finest artists in the world. And these artists all kind of flocked to Vienna. From there, we'll either go on to Prague or to Leipzig, then Leipzig to Berlin, and then down to Salzburg to celebrate Mozart's birthday. This is outside of the Schoenbrunn Palace, the Habsburg Summer Palace in Vienna. This place famously uh, hosted an event where young Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart came and uh, sat on Marie Antoinette's lap and proposed to her. It was very scandalous at the time. It's very common that places would compete. Churches would compete against the aristocracy. Aristocracy would compete against each other and they would want to hire the very best of the best. And so the greatest teachers in the world came to this one centralized area, these five cities. After we finish in Vienna, we'll go on to likely Leipzig. And Leipzig was the home of Johann Sebastian Bach. Also, birthplace of Wagner, Robert Schumann spent some time there, as did Felix Mendelssohn. In the background is St. Thomas's Church, home to a boys' choir that's been there since the 1200s. That was what Bach was hired to teach, that boys' choir, and we'll hear that choir with any luck, the modern iteration of it, because they give concerts on Friday and Saturday. Hearing Bach's music in Bach's home is without peer. Then, this is the uh, Renaissance Town Hall. It housed uh, Bach's office as well as the Bach archives. We'll go on from there to Berlin. Berlin, which was the seat of political power of the Nazi party. We're gonna not shy away from that. We'll actually learn about that as well and the fascinating circumstances uh, that allowed that to happen. The Germans are very open about it and it's really interesting to be there. From there, we'll go on to the gorgeous city of Prague. And Prague was a way station for many composers. Mozart premiered operas there. And uh, this is the Moldau River. They, they call it the Vltava. Just outside of Prague is the Terezin transit camp where the Nazis sent prominent musicians and artists uh, that were then sent on to Auschwitz and unfortunately most lost their lives, an entire generation. And we'll learn about that as well. The beautiful Prague Opera House. And from Prague, on to Salzburg. You'll see the Salz Fortress in the background, and they host an entire week celebration of Mozart and Mozart's music, and so we'll learn about that. And then from there, we'll go back to Vienna for a few days and finish up. This class is, again, designed for anyone who is interested in music, and it does not necessarily require you to have an extensive knowledge. In fact, most of the people that don't come away from this going, you know, I took this for the arts credit and I really didn't know very much about this music and now I'm a fan and that makes me very happy. I'd be very pleased to share this with you and I hope you wish to apply for the class. Thank you very much.